Hi guys, but we're gonna have a video today playing Game of Thrones, but it's the Telltale one, so Yay. Yay. Now I haven't actually played this before, so uh so whoop to die day. And also I don't watch Game of Thrones either, so this is This is a thing. Alright, let's begin. So, I have all of the episodes. Go oh, dragon. Uh, yeah, but I have all of them. So, um, I have every episode. I just haven't got four, five, and six downloaded. But I don't know who any of these characters are. It. No, actually, zombies are cool. But I have the first three downloaded, so let's go. Us guys, uh, a bit of an apology here. Sorry for not uploading in a while, but I will kick it up. Um, with after this video, this should be up on Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. And I'll try to pick up recordings. Thousands of years, House Forrester has been loyal bannermen to House Stark. In the darkest reaches of the Wolfwood, they have harvested rare ironwood trees. Now the North has been ripped apart by war and rival houses seek to claim Forrester and ironwood for themselves. And the fate of House Forrester hangs in the balance. Jamie Lannister, Kingslayer, Oathbreaker, right brought to his knees by the men of the North. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Lord Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. Gods? Make sure it's spotless this time. Lord Forrester won't be happy with blood and brains all over it. Now that is a proper sword. I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. And I say that as a friend. And if we're being honest... Oh, don't be an arse, Bowen. Get wrecked. Apologies, your lordship. I had hand you know. <laughs> hand him what? Capturing him! He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. Next, he'll tell us he caught Tyrion, Shut too. It. <laughs> Shh. Let him finish. Oh, he'll talk all night if you let him. You captured the Kingslayer. Aye. Well, I had a hand in it. Aye. A hand round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? Brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. Not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face! You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story. This grows more far fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. It's your job. Right, thanks. You're welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Would you like some Norrin's wine, pal? has faithfully served House Forrester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach. And House Tully is forever in his debt. They've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. <laughs> Bet your cup. The night we celebrate. Rob Stark, the king in the north! Yes, I get to the king in the north! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor. 
to lead the young wolf's army and ride as the vanguard. The gods are famous. Onward to Castle Rock! Ride! Death to the Lannisters! Uh, this one. Ride! Winter is coming. Ride! Let's hope it waits till this bloody war's over. Got it. Apparently they say that a lot. Yes, my lord. I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question of what's to be done with you. It's been on my mind for a while now. Something must be done. With me, my lord. You've served House Forrester well for several years now. But I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? You served me well. To bring honor to House Forrester, my lord. You have more honor than those who were born to it. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. Yes. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Forrester. I'm gonna go stop. It's well deserved, Garrett. Your hard work has paid off. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. I promise, but for now, man. keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Now go. And find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Thank you, man. Can I have a oh, video yeah. game too? Squire! Fetch us more wine! Can you give me a hand? Come on. Make it up to you. Uh, I'll yeah, try. No problem. I have been a squire longer than you, so. I outrank you. You should help me. Fetch more wine, scrub my armor, clean my boots. Just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. He's a drunk, a liar, and an arrogant prick. I agree. You'd better watch your tongue, Bowen. It could be much worse. What the fuck do you know about it? Oh! Nothing is worse than Nuri. Right. See, that's right, where you're lucky. I feel like there's going to be more of that, so I'm not even going to bother blooding I'd it out. I've grown up covered in pig shit, shovel and slop. Well, maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose this beats pig farming. But not by much. Who doesn't love bacon? Ah, pig farmers. <laughs> All I'm saying is, at this rate, we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the low. For all I know, we could be squires for life. Pulling wine around a fucking wedding. I'm gonna tell him. No, time. I'm just, I'm just, um... Give it time. This one. You'll get there. It's more easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were castling at House Forester, I'd feel different. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? That's right over there. So what's the red wedding then? Again, I don't watch. I don't watch it, so I probably won't get these places. Take your time. You lot have drunk your share. Good thing, Lord Walders, in a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. They gonna need fight. What? What's wrong? Just gotten into you. You're acting rather odd. We need to get back. Now. They're fine, they can wait. No, you don't understand. We need to go. <laughs> Take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong with him? 
Something Them dudes man, gonna huh? hurt Boy, you. We have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. Gonna stop you. Uh, no, Forrester or my friend. My friend. Or the Lord. Um. Should I save the king? Or save my friend? Wait, no, it said warn, didn't it? Yeah, it said warn. So I think he's gonna die either way, because it doesn't say that I can save him. So. I'm gonna save Bowen? Screw it, just save Bowen. <coughs> but, what about? What the hell was that about? Slow down, would you? What's the rush? Run! Oh man. These guys suck at fighting. We need to get back to camp. These guys suck at fighting. Just get annihilated. Oh, I didn't even see that. Nothing I could do. Find a weapon quickly. Oh, yeah, I start to get the fight proper.
You wounded, my lord. I've suffered worse. All the brave this time, so <gasps> with your life. Return it to Ironrath, where it belongs. There's no time to waste. It's me, no. I'll be damned if I let it fall into the hands of those traitors. What the phrase says you have to go. Stage, you're welcome. To the fucking torch. I, I won't leave you, my lord. You can, and you will. My lord, I... The God, he will remember you will that. obey me. He will remember it for the next 15 seconds that he lives. Tell your uncle... <laughs> Tell him, the North Grove must never be lost. Tell no one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. I swear that I will, my lord. Hey, it's those forests. Go. On your honor, you must do this for your house. Go! Kill those <clears throat> fucking foresters! Well, he's dead. <laughs> 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 We love this one, Frey! Wow, is that my run? Is that the run I have to live with for the rest of my life? Oh, no! Copyright music! No, blah 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 copyright. Right. Um la 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 copyright music blah 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 i don't think blah please don't pick it up system i swear um I'm pro I'll, I'll probably cut this out for now i don't know what it's called i'll just keep talking but please system don't pick this up i promise i'm not copyright it but yeah this is a telltale game it's um it's got copyrighted music it sucks um, um, uh, Iron Man, that's the most way to put the sword in. It's out of course, it's over sure that this is a game of being good. I need to keep talking. I mean, I'm usually the thing that I'm going to do this, though. It's, what about game, what about Monopoly of Chairs? Yes, copyright avoided. Avo copyright avoided. This is the way I'm gonna walk the full game. Yeah, but honestly though, he's dead now. I've got his sword. Oh yeah, he must have died then either way because um, there's no way that um, this entire story would be about the sword, but only if I chose to help my friend. So. In fact, I don't even know if that music was even copyrighted, but better safe than sorry, I guess. That's father's car. Oh, that was a great Lord car right there. Better give us fucking titles for this. Winter may be coming, but at least still have his bacon. Oh, I didn't know I was still controlling. Oh god damn, it's them phrases again. I think it is it phrase they're called? <laughs> no! <laughs> Mr. McBacon, you will be Move it on, boy! There's nothing for you here. Father, I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. You're I'm pig. going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? That sword's like twice as You can as try if me. you like. And then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get off my land. This is Bolton land now, boy. 
Once she gets off my is the land, I'll build North. a ten foot wall. I reckon he'd like it. a proper lordly sword like that. <coughs> oh, I didn't. Alright, quick time events. <coughs> <coughs> I'll have that sword, boy. Aye, you'll have it. Through you. Get ready. Oh, God damn it. Uh, my sword. All right. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. Um. You really are a pig farmer, aren't you? Oh, you know what? I'm gonna pitchfork you in the face. I'm ready for the quick team events now. So get right. Oh, right in the neck. Looks like they don't even flinch. My sword here. Ah, my leg. That's my leg, you. That leg's me. Please. I beg of you. I, I have a family. They'll never survive without me. I have no quarrel with you. I, I was only following orders. Uh, fine, we come with you. Thank you. Off with you. Get off my land. Lord Whitefield will see you hang for this. That much I promise. <laughs> Daddy. Father? Garrett, you survived. Your, your sister. She hid. Just plugging in my controller. I tried to stop them. There we go. Low battery. I'll Thanks. kill the men who did this. I mean, I already killed one of them. Oh, wait a minute. I'll kill the men who did this, yet one of them I let run away. Oh, well. <laughs> wait, did I limp all the way here? Because in the intro, you saw how far away the it's place is. Garrett! Get the Castellan! Tell him his nephew survived! <sighs> Garrett! I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the Maester! Meet us in the Great Hall! Quickly! Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she. She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in Didn't he say, though, that it's she had? Unimaginable. Or did it show her dead and they just didn't see her for she You was have hidden. my condolences. Thank you, Mister. Blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. But the White Hills won't see it that way. Blam. I'd do it again if I had the chance. If we don't respond with strength, they won't stop until they have everything. 
These maggots ought to help prevent infection. You put the wound open for me, would you? Leg. I'm scared. <laughs> I just put maggots in my leg. Disgusting. These are dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house will never fall. By the gods, let's hope you're right. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now, although he is young and altogether unprepared to lead. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of warcraft. That's not how it happened. Roderick had already fallen. Hmm. Although I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house. I all know. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. Wait a minute, I'd like so you to walk for me first. How long are those maggots going to go on my leg for? Because that's just bloody disgusting. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Right. That's good enough. <laughs> uh, look at this. Yeah, well, I'm just going to quickly finish this off, finish this video off, and then start another one so that I don't run out of space. So I'll just beat it back. Alright, and we're back. You guys didn't, probably didn't notice the thing, but what I did was I cut the video so I can record and that works. The Ironwood Grove. Medicinal supples. I uh, did. You can't find that disgusting. Really. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? Yeah, you knowing that they're I in guess. your leg. Uh, well, this might help. <laughs> I, just, I just picked these up and I'm just hmm. taking these. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Maestro Tengren. Look, I'll show you. This is how I walk. I'm gonna look at you. Just really look at you. Keep moving. I need to see you walk. Have I not been walking for the past ten minutes? Mm. It's a good thing you've done, bringing that back to House Forrester. By right, that belongs to Lord Ethan now. Well, it's mine, so shot at you. Uh, no, you see there? You're limping again. I'm fine, really.
Mirror. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Mirror, mirror. Although, on the wall. I wonder if they'll bring her home. In the tapestry. Yeah. Lady Forrester. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a Forrester myself. Talia and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. Asher. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Ryan. Never easy being the fourth born son. Yeah, rip these two. Roderick. He was our best warrior by far. And this dude. Lord Forrester. It was an honor to squire for him. Gregor the Good. Alright, I'm I'll not going to look at the codex. You do page. seem better than was to be expected. I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but. Lady Forrester. Oh, home, hello there. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Yeah, I do. I found it. Family. I'm sorry. Are you better for bringing that up? Stab you in my great sword. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Whatever you can recall. It was a hero, my lady. The bravest man on the battlefield by far. Yet he was unable to save his own son. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He... He fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us. Especially the children. But I was told, I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed, if you can remember. It would mean so much to the family. He asked me to return this to House Forrester. He said this is where it belongs. Because remember, with his family. I did avoid a question. Thank you. you know. I can tell a bit of more school because you said to me. They demand a response. It's too dangerous, especially so. now. Now is the time to prove our strength. Get out of here. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. But it sucks that we had to give up the Duncan, sword. This was our it. land. They were our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Royland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Ooh. Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. Ramsay Snow is coming here. Yes, Aye. Snow is coming. He'll arrive within the week. Those men will say they were keeping the peace in the name of House Bolton. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Actual Garrett has lost as much as anyone else man. within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. It was his family they killed. My uncle's right. We need to be smart. Smart. Eddard Stark was smart. And look where that got him. And you're being a smart officer. So, what's to be There's done? There's the door. Bag her off. <sighs> Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. But I'll accuse you of murder, and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he no. did. I'd have done the same, Square. as any man would. Bam. Fuck the Boltons. One of their men killed my family. Aye, 
You'll say it was justice. They'll say it was murder. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take. Which is why you cannot stay. Cannot stay? Duncan, the boy has suffered enough. You can't send me away. We have no choice, Garrett. Where would you have the boy go? The one place that's safe, beyond the reach of the Boltons. You're sending him to the wall? The boy's done nothing wrong! Not in the eyes of the Boltons. <clears throat> I'm afraid it's the only solution. Especially now, when the house is so vulnerable. I'll do what's, what's best the for the wall? house. So I'll go. I'm not afraid. I know it doesn't seem fair, but it is what's best. Like, they're talking about, like, I'm not a criminal and stuff. And, like, that saying settles that it then. Justice, is it like a big prison? You can have my horse, and I'll see yeah. you have plenty of food. But we haven't much time. The White Hills will come looking for you. <laughs> nice. Got me a cup of tea. Word up to me. I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart if given the chance. I would. And God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the House ahead of your own. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. I'll do what's best. Which often isn't what's easiest, but necessary nonetheless. Yeah, well... I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. What? Lord Forrester asked me to give uh, you a message. When I get a chance, I'll end he off said, the episode. The North Grove can never be lost. Sorry. You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. What is the North Grove? Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools, and it's better kept that way. You haven't told anyone else, have you? No, I was a bit... This is important, I Garrett. I need to know the truth. Of course not. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. Yes? From this day forward, this will be our secret. But soon, I may need your help. But I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. Become a ranger if you can. It will help. from ice I am from ice remember you represent house Forrester your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house I'll serve with honor I know you will to be taking it. All right. Be safe. Can I not say I will tank her? off this episode here so if you guys did enjoy this video please do leave a like and subscribe for more see you guys in this video goodbye